What's good, everyone? Welcome to another episode of Wacko Adventures. I'm sorry. All right, so as many of you know, I'm a big Star Wars fan. For those who don't know, yeah. Disney, they gave a little sneak peek on Galaxy's Edge. This huge oh. news. Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Once I heard about this, of course, I just geeked out. I am a Jedi! I am a Jedi! I am a Jedi! This photo gives you a great insight what to expect for this new addition for Disneyland Park. Now this is gonna be one of the rides where you're able to go ahead and sit in the cockpit of the Millennium Falcon. You've never heard of the Millennium Falcon? Should I have? It's a ship that made the Kessel run in less than 12 parsecs. I don't know what any of that means. It's going to be exciting. From what I understand, how you fly the ship and how you do in the mission reflects on how people are going to interact with you in the park. So are you ready for the new addition over at Disneyland Star Wars Galaxy Edge? Let me know in the comments below. Let me know whether you are or you're not and why. It's going to be $4,000 to go to Disneyland. See ya real soon. Yo, what's up? This is Wacko Man. We're over here at the music festival. You're gonna go ahead and follow me and you can see the behind the scenes of what the media staff does. A lot of people tend to neglect what the uh, BTS people do and provide for all these types of events, all different types of concerts. Without media, to be honest, there really isn't anything for uh, anyone to know what is and what's going on. Hey, you had your schedule, right? The new one? I got the old one. Just go off that one, dude, because that's what's been going off. Nothing's been changed whatsoever. Okay. Or uh, We're already also, running 10 minutes late. Yeah, already online too, dude. Like on the um, on the uh, Instagram, they posted up the fucking set time. The set times too. Are you ready for today? Oh yeah. Now, these days, Lisa said well, we got we want to get fresh. We put on our work clothes. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, 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 no. There's no room to get fresh around this shit, bro. Yeah, this is the second stage right here. So, and then this is the skate section over here. No worries, at, but it's already 1:25, and it's it. If they're not here for the set time, skip them. They're not here, man. We gotta keep the ball rolling. To be honest, there hasn't been much on the slide, like much action. There's been like a few little. As long as you're checking in on that, I've been going that out, then that's good. So, no, I went and got some skate, I got some six skate footage. Dope. Yeah, dope, dope. And then just whatever you're walking around, some random shit, lifestyle shit, dude. But, that one in camera things? Yeah. Is that one in cameras? I thought they only pulled those out in the bedroom. <laughs> it's really stressful to make sure that we captured every single possible moment for the event because it's important that this content gets utilized for any marketing material for the next event and especially for uh, a recap video which is really common nowadays because people want to see what they missed and what they expect for the next event. So shout out to everybody that was involved with that. Really do appreciate you guys. Good work. So finally with this segment here, I want to go ahead and do some more BTS on a photo shoot and video shoot that I was involved with with my good friends over at Vegan Smart. Um, I worked with my mentor, Tyler Clinton. I also got uh, introduced and to work for the first time with Badass Vegan. If you don't know this guy, you have to follow him. He's full of inspiration and very inspiring. Also, I got to work with pro surfer, Tia Blanco. So let's check out this BTS with my good peeps 
at Vegan Smart. everyone that concludes this episode of wacko's adventures hopefully you had some fun make sure you guys subscribe go ahead and do a thumbs up drop a comment below let me know what your thoughts are do you like you don't like you know i want to get some more insight from you guys and get some feedback from you guys because wacko's adventures is just pretty much about me going out and experiencing so many different things and so many people and taking my camera along with me. So go ahead, give me some feedback on that, you guys, because this is really all about you and it's just about me sharing all the different experiences and the different people that I come across. Head over to wackofilms.com for uh, past episodes and I'll catch you guys on the next episode.